You are my sister, but I am king now. You start wearing a crown. When you question my decisions in front of the other lords and ladies, you undermine me. We can't question your decisions anymore. Of course you can, but... Joffrey some... never let anyone question his authority. You think he was a good king? Do you think I'm Joffrey? You're as far from Joffrey as anyone I've ever met. Thank you. You're good at this, you know. At what? At ruling. No. You are. You are. They respect you, they really do, but you have to... Why are you laughing? What did Father used to say? Everything before the word but is horse shit. Never said that to me. No. No, I never cursed in front of his girls. Because he was trying to protect us. He never wanted us to see how dirty the world really is, but Father couldn't protect me, neither can you. Stop trying. All right, I'll stop trying to protect you, and you stop trying to undermine I'm me. I'm not trying to undermine you. You have to be smarter than Father. You need to be smarter than Rob. I loved them, I missed them, but they made stupid mistakes, and they both lost their heads for it. And how should I be smarter? By listening to you. Would that be so terrible? A raven from King's Landing, Your Grace. Cersei of House Lannister, first of her name, Queen of the Andals and the First Men, protector of the Seven Kingdoms. What does she want? Come to King's Landing. Bend the knee or suffer the fate of all traitors. You've been so consumed with the enemy to the north, you've forgotten about the one to the south. I'm consumed with the Night King because I've seen him. And believe me, you'd think of little else if you had to. We still have a wall between us and the Night King. There's nothing between us and Cersei. There's a thousand miles between us and Cersei. Winter is here. The Lannisters are a southern army. They've never ranged this far north. You're the military man, but I know her. If you're her enemy, she'll never stop until she's destroyed you. Everyone who's ever crossed her, she's found a way to murder. You almost sound as if you admire her. I learned a great deal from her. No! You're a lucky man. I've heard she beat the hound in single combat. She's a very impressive woman. What do you want, Lord Baelish? I want you to be happy. I want you to be safe. I am safe. I'm at home, surrounded by friends. I have Brienne to protect me from anyone who would harm me. What about happy? Why aren't you happy? What do you want that you do not have? At the moment, peace and quiet. No need to seize the last word, Lord Baelish. I assume it was something clever. My lady. My lady. Why is he still here? We need his men. Without the veil, Ramsay Bolton would still hold this castle. Littlefinger saved us. He wants something. I know exactly what he wants. I think it's really tearing. It could be someone trying to lure you into a trap. Read the last bit. 
All dwarves are bastards in their father's eyes. What does that mean? It's something he said to me the first night we met. You know him better than any of us. What do you think? Tyrion's not like the other Lannisters. He was always kind to me, but it's too great a risk. The Seven Kingdoms will bleed as long as Cersei sits on the Iron Throne. Join us. Together we can end her tyranny. Sounds like a charmer. Of course, the casual mention of a Dothraki horde, a legion of unsullied and three dragons, a bit less charming. What? Fire kills whites, you told me. What breathes fire? You're not suggesting John meet with her? No, too dangerous. But? But if the army of the dead makes it past the wall, do we have enough men to fight them? 